All right, guys, I'm just going to show you really quick how to go in and add your clock hours into Calypso. It's actually not that hard, but it's pretty counterintuitive. So once you get to this screen, you just click on clock hours and then you go up to daily clock hours. And um, I have this here because I've already added a uh, drop down. So you actually have to add one. You have to add your own drop down to this. So if you're like me, I only had the fall one here to begin with, so I was kind of confused. But you have to add each one for each instructor or supervisor you have. So um, you just go to add new daily clock hour, and then you just find all the information, you put it in here. Once you're done with that, then you hit save, and then it'll look like mine. So then you just go back to your daily clock hours and then you'll find from the drop down the one that you added. So let's say, let's say I want to add on to this one. So to enter my clock hours, you're going to reference your Excel spreadsheet, and then you're going to make sure that you um, input in the correct area. So you have to click, I did not know this, and the other video didn't really explain this. To input your hours, you have to click on the date thingy, and then you go in and you can input your hours and minutes. And so like on this one, I put in for three hours, 45 minutes, and um, that's pretty much it. And then I'm thinking I hit save somewhere, maybe not. Um, I think I hit save anyway, um, because it's already been submitted for her review. So let me look on uh, another one that I haven't submitted already. Let's see. So I'm going to say show this one. Um, so I didn't include that, sorry. So you have to click on the one that you want, then you have to hit show. Then you're going to click on the date. Then you're going to enter in whatever hours. Make sure it's under the correct heading. And then after you enter that, then you're going to hit save. And then when you go back to this screen, it'll show your hours down here. You'll want to check this box. Let's say I've entered my hours somewhere down in here. Then you're going to check the box, and then you're going to submit selected clock hours for supervisor approval. That's it. So it's really not that hard. It just is kind of counterintuitive, and it's not, <laughs> I don't know, it's not very clear, I don't think. So hopefully that helps.